Hey everybody, I hope all is well with you and your family and your garden. Um, <laughs> my garden is really hanging in there. Kind of the sentiment of my life right now. But, um, it's a good hanging. It's a good hanging. I have a lot of tomatoes. I'm about to go ahead and grab up out of here real quick and I'm gonna water her up. What's going on with this? Did it, oh, it's right on here. I ain't never seen that before. You know, it's doing good. Jalapenos, my cayennes, and these, oh wow. Look all the flowers and more coming in. I might go ahead and harvest them. But, um, yeah, it's a beautiful mess right now. My garden is a beautiful mess. The seedlings I just started the other day are looking great. Um, all those green beans have came up really well. Oh, wow. The cabbage has come up. The tomatoes have came up. And I don't see any spinach yet. But everything is looking good. More tomatoes need to come. Green beans still producing. Okay. So I, I did pop a few corns in this raised bed. It's like I just keep starting seeds and I just pop them in. So these are the cucumbers I started the other, I put in the other day. And it's a beautiful mess. There's definitely time to get these um, potatoes harvested. So that'll be coming up shortly. But I just wanted to walk around a little bit. Oh, wow, look at the blooms. A tad bit and water the garden. And show you guys a little bit and let you guys know that I've been well. Um, got a lot going on in my family right now, but who doesn't? <laughs> and we're going to handle it just like we've been handling it. But I know a few of you guys have been asking where I've been in these YouTube streets. And just know I have a really good reason as to why I disappeared um, very shortly after our win of the MIG Grow Out 2022 with Team That Sauce. Um... I love working with my team, but shortly after that, I kind of went ghost a little bit from YouTube streets. When I have a little bit of time, I stop and watch a few videos and comment when I can. But, you know, things are a little, a little rough right now for my family. But, hey, we'll get through it. I appreciate Broke Farmer for reaching out and um, asking about me. Just know we're good. But, yeah, y'all, let me get some of these tomatoes harvested and I'll show you what all I got. All right, so all of these tomatoes, I'm about to take them to work and give them away tomorrow. I decided to go ahead and harvest these jalapenos. Well, these are not a Fuyu. See the tag Fuyu jalapenos? So they're not as hot. I'm going to go ahead and take both of them. They're very firm. Beautiful. And I'm gonna go ahead and take these two banana peppers. Oh wow, I came right off. Will this one come off that easy? No. Guess it was ready to go. These cayennes, I believe they have to finish turning red. And they're already starting, so I'm gonna leave those there. But this is all harvest for tonight. It looks beautiful, the colors. <laughs> Colors look beautiful. The corn that I saved for my own seed are coming up. Well, all of them came up, but that one died. But these are all for my seed stock. They're looking really good. All the seedlings are looking good. I mean, it's been over 100 degree temps, so they're kind of taking it rough. I think I need to. I think I'm going to put this seedling down here so I can get some more shade. These will be fine. The stars of the show. Look at these peppers. These are cayenne peppers. I mean, it's three pretty red ones on here. And more coming in. More coming in. So I'm going to go ahead and harvest these. You can see it better from this angle. Uh-oh. So much stuff in here. And more banana peppers. Look at this big pretty one. I'm about to get all of these. So... Let's see, go ahead and get these cayennes. Two, I'm gonna get all three of these. 
Uh oh. They're beautiful. Ooh, they smell so good. See? And these banana peppers, they usually come right on off. Nope. <laughs> Let me cut them. Oh, these weeds out. Man, I've been having this, this summer garden. It's been ridiculous with these weeds. It's been ridiculous. Okay. Dang. Banana pepper. I'm getting more jalapenos coming back. You know, life of a cherry tomato grower. You're going to always have those to harvest. So I went ahead and grabbed those as well. I got a flat prepared and took all the green beans that I started. And I think I'm going to go ahead and put them in this flat. So I already um fertilized this a little bit. Ooh, something biting me out here. Ooh, it's actually a kind of cool day. So I've been trying to make my way out to the garden because I really haven't been out there like this. And it's a little overcast. So, and it's actually drizzling, so I'm here to do this. But being that it's overcast, it allowed me the opportunity to get some work done. So, I'm gonna put a good little show you guys. Sorry, I'm twisting the camera. I'm gonna put two long trenches down the middle and I'm gonna put them in. And I will show y'all what it look like when I get back because I'm working kind of fast. All right, so this is an idea of how I think I want to plant them. You can plant these bush green beans a little closer together. And they're all in. They're tucked in. I'm going to water them in. <clears throat> Even though it's about to rain, I want to still give them a good little soaking. All right, so now that I got those in, you know what's next. Oh, oh, God, I dropped them. I was about to say time to drop more seeds. Let me pick these up. I definitely didn't find all of them, but I'm going to just go ahead and sow the ones I did find. Man, I'm mad I dropped those seeds. Whew. That's so, and that's a needle in a haystack. So, well, at least I got some. It looks like it's about to rain, but I'm gonna still water them in. Whew. Just in case. I should have bought two packs out, but it's okay. So, all of these back here have seeds. So now, now I'm about to prepare two grow bags. I got this one ready and I'm about to get this one ready and go ahead and put some of my um, beefsteak tomatoes in it and get them out of this container here. Okay, I got some fertilizer in here. Work that in a little bit. Let's go with this one. This roots out. This is a larger one, go bag, so I'm not going to put it all the way up. <clears throat> you know, I might spearmint and put two in this bag. Whew, okay. Let me get one of these little seedlings out, y'all. You know, tomatoes, they can handle this rough housing. Okay, got one out. I think I'm gonna take two for this one. <clears throat> I'm gonna water this in so it'll it'll pack right back down and won't be any issues Ugh. with those. Those will continue growing. Okay. Oh, I actually took three. Oh, well. Let's put three in here then. See what happens. Alright. Whew. I think that's all I could do today, y'all. We'll water these in. 